to get the free notes of electrical circuits check the link in the comment section and install the app for free Thevenin's theorem question find the value of current i by using Thevenin's theorem solution first of all let's see the statement of Thevenin's theorem Thevenin's theorem states that a linear two terminal circuit can be replaced by an equivalent circuit consisting of a voltage source VTH in series with resistor RTH where VTH is the open circuit voltage at the terminals and RTH this is RTH RTH is the equivalent resistance at the terminals when all the independent sources are turned off and this will be our load resistor RL and this is load current IL this is called as Thevenin equivalent resistance this is Thevenin's equivalent Thevenin's equivalent circuit we can say it is Thevenin's equivalent circuit and here this IL is equal to VTH divided by RTH plus RL now here we can see the value of RL is 3 ohm so here we can write RL is equal to 3 ohm and the value of IL is IL value is current I small current I now we need to find the value of VTH and RTH so let's find the value of RTH to find RTH first what we have to do we have to remove RL and turn off all independent sources turn off all the independent sources now when we turn off all the independent sources from here and if we remove this RL so this will be our RTH and when we turn off a voltage source that time it will be short circuited here also this is a voltage source so when we turn off a voltage source again this will be short circuited now here we can see this 1 ohm and this 2 ohm are connected in series and this 2 ohm is connected in parallel to this so it will be 3 ohm or here we can write RTH is equal to 3 ohm parallel with 2 ohm so it will be 3 multiplied by 2 divided by 3 plus 2 so if we solve we get RTH RTH is equal to 3 into 2 divided by 3 plus 2 so it is 1.2 ohm is the value of RTH now next let's find the value of VTH so to find VTH to find VTH again what we have to do we have to remove RL and here we can write VTH is equal to VOC that is open circuit voltage will be equal to VTH so here if we remove this load register now this will be our VTH or V open circuit voltage now to find this VTH first of all let's apply KVL to the outer loop of this circuit so this is the outer loop and let's say this is current capital I now according to this current I direction let's assign the sign this will be positive here negative here positive negative positive here and negative here now let's apply KVL to the outer loop outer loop of circuit 
let's say we are starting from this point so it will be minus 5 then this will be plus 2i plus 2i then plus 1i plus 1i means we can write i then plus 2i plus 2i then plus 4 plus 4 now here the loop is completed so it is equal to 0 so this will be 2 plus 1 3 3 plus 2 5 so it will be 5i and this minus 5 plus 4 will be minus 1 is equal to 0 so therefore 5i is equal to 1 and therefore i is equal to 1 by 5 so 1 divided by 5 it is 0 0.2 so it is 0 0.2 ampere is the value of current i now let's say this is mesh number 1 with current i1 let's say now here we will apply let's copy this circuit from here now let's apply kvl to mesh 1 let's say we are starting from this point again so it will be minus 5 then plus 2 i1 plus 2 i1 then plus 1 i1 so plus 1 i1 then plus vth is equal to 0 plus vth is equal to 0 now here we can see this i is equal to i1 i is equal to i1 and the value of i is 0 0.2 so let's substitute 0 0.2 here so it will be minus 5 plus 2 into 0 0.2 plus 0 0.2 plus vth is equal to 0 now let's simplify this so it will be 5 minus 5 then plus 2 into 0 0.2 then plus 0 0.2 so it is minus 4.4 volt minus 4.4 volt plus vth is equal to 0 so therefore vth is equal to 4.4 volt so this is how we can find the value of vth now we got the value of vth and rth we can draw thevenin equivalent circuit so let's copy it from here and let's substitute all the values the value of vth is 4.4 volt the value of rth is 1.2 ohm 1.2 ohm and the value of rl is 3 ohm so it will be of 3 ohm and the value of il is current i so small i il in place of il we will substitute i in place of vth it will be 4.4 divided by rth value is 1.2 then plus rl value is 3 so if we solve this we get the value of current i so 4.4 divided by 1.2 plus 3 so it is 1.047 1.047 Four seven ampere is the value of current i so i is equal to 1.047 ampere so this is how we can find the value of current i by using thevenin's theorem check the link in the comment section and install the app for free thanks for watching